When Elizabeth was younger, in her early twos, we just started to have some questions about her language development, and then ultimately at the end of first grade, she was diagnosed um, as on the autism spectrum from mild to moderate, and we didn't know what to do. And I came here in April, and the moment I walked in, I knew it. It was like I finally exhaled this breath that I didn't know I'd been holding. Sometimes it feels like when you're dealing with these diagnoses with your children, or you're dealing with a really significant disability or delay, it's all the things your kids can't do. But at JB, it's a whole paradigm shift. Here's what we believe Elizabeth can do. Here's what we know Elizabeth can do. Here's what Elizabeth will do. I don't even think, I'm 100% sure that because everyone in this building believes in Elizabeth, she believes in herself. At other schools, she would be Elizabeth, but she wouldn't be the best version of Elizabeth. And here she is, and that means a lot to me. Deeply, I wish that I had known that I'm not alone. And I think the way the community impacted me so immediately is because I realized that everyone else had a story like mine and like Elizabeth's, and it felt so freeing. You can't describe what it feels like to drop them off at a school every day and know when they walk in that door, everyone in there believes in them, and they'll believe in her all day and then beyond. And it's so special to me. It's so hard, but this place makes it like I believe I can do it.